I've got you under my skin. I have got you deep in the heart of me. You are the sound so is unmistakable. The heart movements, heart. the attitude, it's all of what made Frank Sinatra Sinatra. Bob Anderson continues to bring Frank Sinatra to life on stage. One review said, I saw Frank Sinatra last night. I don't care if it was Bob Anderson, I saw Frank Sinatra. High praise indeed. Welcome. Hey, Joe, thank you for having me. It is great to have you with well, us. It's my pleasure. Uh, so let's go <clears throat> back because Vegas plays such an important part of how you got into the business and where you are today. I exactly. think it involves the Everly Brothers. It did. Uh, I was just 21 years old when I came to Las Vegas. Uh, by accident, I was going to Los Angeles. I didn't know Route 66 took me to, out of Chicago. I wound up there, and I walked into the Sahara Hotel, and uh, I walked into the Congress showroom at 3 in the afternoon. The Everly Brothers and Nancy Sinatra on stage rehearsing. And I sat there. I snuck in. Nobody knew I was there. All of a sudden, they got in a big fight. Make the story short. They left after rehearsing for a week. Nancy was stuck. She didn't have an act. I walked up to the stage and said, Nancy, I'm a singer. I can do whatever you need. Now, I was never in show business, Joe, or nothing. And they all looked at me and laughed. I had cut off song, long hair, peace sign. For, I even drove a Volkswagen. So anyway, I opened the show, and I wound up staying with Nancy for, uh, for a, a couple of tours. And she took me on the Merv Griffin show, then the Mike Douglas show, and then the Johnny Carson show, and that stuff. And that started. But you, it's not only Frank Sinatra. No. But, you know, it's Sammy Davis Jr. Um, it, it's Tony, Tony Bennett. Bennett. Mel Torme. Tom um, Jones. Tom Jones. Johnny Mathis. All those people. When yeah. did you discover that you could do these impressions? Well, when Nancy Sinatra, uh, when I was working with her, she took me to, to a Merv Griffin show. She said, I'm going to go do the Merv Griffin show. You want to come along? I said, yeah. I got there. I introduced me to Merv, and Merv said, would you like to sing a song? <laughs> and I said, yeah, okay. So I sang, if a picture paints, you know. And so we <laughs> did it. And uh, I, I just, uh, I wasn't doing impressions, okay? I was working in a club in, in Los Angeles called the E Little Club on Cannon Boulevard with Joan Rivers, little workshop. Merv Griffin walked in one day and said, I've got, come to my uh, home on Sunday. It's my 50th birthday party. I walked in, Joe. Everybody was there from Kirk Douglas to, uh, to uh, J Jimmy Stewart to Henry Fonda. They were all at this Elizabeth Taylor at Griffin's 50th birthday party. He asked me if I wanted to sing. All of a sudden, he started playing the piano. I, I sounded like Tony Bennett and Andy Williams. <laughs> I never even knew it, because I never did it in my know? life. No, but I grew up listening to them, you know, and trying to say, I want to learn to sing. Well, the transformation to Frank Sinatra is mm -hmm. incredible. Yeah. And I think a lot of it is the eyes. Would yeah. you agree? Yes. Uh -huh. Yes, and it is. Take us through what you went through in order to create this. I have well, okay, you. I started it. Uh, it, it took me. I, I worked I uh, as being Frank Sinatra. I used to get up, and I was working I with Andy Williams in you. Missouri. And I'd get up in the morning, and I would go downstairs in the, in the lower part of my house. And I put mirrors all around, and I would put a tuxedo on at 5.30 in the morning. And I did it uh, four days a week for a year. And I put a video on watching every move Sinatra makes, what he does when he, how he looks, uh, how you look, and he goes, he's got this, but then of course you know that. I've got you under my skin and everything that he would do. And the, the, his gestures, his voice, and the whole thing. And I did it for a year, so, um, and, it, and it was in, right here now. So it's, it's really very, I walk on stage now in the makeup. You know, Kazusuji Academy Award winning, makeup artist who did uh, Churchill uh, this year. He won the Oscar for. Um, uh, he did my makeup. and uh, it, It's phenomenal. I mean, it really is such a transformation. You you have some shows coming up yes. uh, in February. That's right. Okay. Here. Here at the McCallum. Exactly. Uh, but we want to have you back before that. Uh, Joe, but I'd love to. Before you leave, though, mm -hmm. we want to give folks a taste of uh, Frank Sinatra on stage, okay. which is you. Okay, great. Let's fly, let's fly away. And if you can use some exotic booze, now there's a bar in Far Pompeii. Come fly with me, let's fly, let's fly away. Come fly, let a gentleman see. How nice a day. 
Thank you so much for being here. 